Welcome back to The Walking Dead. A few weeks back, there might have been a station wagon in the forest, full of all sorts of food, water, things you need to survive. Oh no. Yeah. I'm not some cannibal, Lee. No. Some killer out in the woods. Some... No. Villain. I'm just a... Dad. I coach Little League. Everything was just out there for the taking. We were starving. For Do the you're... taking? Do you know what you took from me? I'm sorry. Whatever it is, whatever happened, you have to hear that I'm sorry. That doesn't mean anything to me. I wish it did. I'm not a bad man. I don't believe in vengeance. But I've got nothing left. <sighs> Have you ever hurt somebody you care about? Yeah. Yes, of course. Who? Guy named Kenny. I hurt her so bad. My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said, You are a monster. We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her so bad. Then you took all of our things. You robbed us. I could have earned her trust back, Lee, but not after that. I'm sorry. Oh, God. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. They didn't get far. I found them. Oh, no, later. no, no. In the road. I'm sorry. Do I look like a monster to you? What would have happened if I hadn't taken it? No. I'm not like you. You let that little girl get fed disgusting human meat. I didn't mean to. I did my best. You let a boy get yanked out of a window and into the night. So you could protect a pretty girl with she a gun. She saved my life. What had he done? It was impossible to save him. To save them both. The sweatshirt she's wearing was my boy's. You stole that from us. We didn't know. We thought he was abandoned. That's not the whole story. The whole story? Oh. He's been right behind us every step of the way. You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm gonna hurt you so That would make bad. you no better than me. Just give me, Clementine, Just give me Clementine back. I'd rather kill her myself. Because that's what will happen if she goes with you. After I heard Clementine on the radio and realized who you folks were, I came after you purely for revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Lee, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's eight. Wrong. She's nine. But... Her birthday was six days ago. I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. No. 
Shut up. It makes sense. It's not happening. I'm bitten. What? I got bit, and I'm gonna make sure you end up the same way as me. I, uh... Make sure you shoot me in the head. No. No. I'll be with her, and you'll be rotting in the streets. Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. What are you... Oh, what's in the bag? I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt <laughs> Oh no, 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 no. Sorry, I don't have very quick reactions. Oh. Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. What are you? I'm glad too. I wish you wouldn't have had to get Lamp. this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. Smack I miss you head. so much, Tess. Smack him in the You're gonna head. like Clementine Smack a lot, though. Head. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. Smack him in the head. She wouldn't Smack hurt him in the head. No! Yeah. <laughs> 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 Deserved it. I know we took his stuff, but he killed Lee. He would have come back. That's right, sweet pea. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shh. It's okay. It's okay. gone. Why? That's so scary. I had an accident. We'll talk about it somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. Did, Did he hurt you? His pants? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Clem, it's okay. Need to get you somewhere safe, and then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. I'm sorry you had to see that. He was going to kill you. And take you. Yeah. Jesus. Don't look in there. No, I know. Which 
way out. Through there. Savannah. Oh, she's not gonna like that. Let's be perfectly oh, hysterical. No. We'll be covered in dead corpse either. See. folks if you like this video please leave a like and subscribe to become a ballistic penguin today thank you for watching and i'll see you next time bye bye <laughs>